Excuse the lighting. Nowhere in my room has good lighting. So yeah. So um, you're gonna have to deal with this, this lighting. Yes, that is a wine bottle. I'm 19, believe it or not. Archie, stop nicking treats. You're meant to be asleep. You're naughty. Now you're biting me. Anyway, hi guys. Welcome back to my channel. If you've been here before, and welcome to my channel if you're new. I'm currently being bitten by my dog. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video of me being attacked by my dog. And on the bed. I can't sit on my bed because my bed, the slats keep coming off. So I have to sit on a beanbag. But hey, I finally got the beanbag in my room. Anyway, so today's video is Have You Ever? And I'm going to put out scenarios of things that seem like other people would have have done in their lifetime and you comment down below if you've done them if youtube doesn't disable my comments because i never do that youtube just like yep yeah, no one commenting like i don't know why they do that but they do that so have you ever been singing a song since your childhood and now you're in your adulthood and you still don't know who sings it or the name of the song for me, since my childhood, I've been singing the song that goes, I don't care what the people may say, what the people may say, pack up your troubles in your old bin bag and bury them beneath the sea. I've been singing that since I was like, before double digits. I'm like, yep, yeah, still don't know who sings that song. Still don't know the name of that song. Still don't know any of the other lyrics, but I like the song. <laughs> and my dog's farted. Have you ever owned a dog that farts so much? This is my second one that farts so much you fart, don't you? Have you ever met someone that if you... Right, have you ever met someone that if murder was legal, you would kill them? Because I have met many people like that many many people and i'm like <laughs> so you don't deserve life because you're just evil and you're horrible people like why are you here okay third thing have you ever wondered why good people die like more good people die compared to bad people this this has become very morbid this is I didn't I didn't expect this video to become morbid. Oh this one is really really relatable. Have you ever been in a relationship with someone that doesn't actually want to see you? I have. She dumped me though. And it was a fucking relief. <laughs> it was a fucking relief. I read the message and I was like, yeah. Yeah, bullshit, bullshit, yeah, bullshit. No, that's you, you're talking about yourself. Yeah, sorry, we're over. And the first thing I said, yeah, was what a fucking relief. Well, actually, I said about time, but same thing. And yes, I have written on my door, but I'll, I'll wash it. It comes off, except for the part that's nail varnish. <laughs> have you ever blocked someone because all they do is talk to you when they have a message to give to you from someone else or they only talk to you when someone else wants to talk to you like, why don't that other person talk to me then like hello <laughs> I've done that before basically all these scenarios I've done this before um Okay, this is one I haven't done. Have you ever been on a date and then used the excuse of, oh, I need to go to the toilet, and then you climb out the window? I've never done that because I've never... In my, I, I refuse to use public toilets. They're disgusting and gross, and there's other people there. I don't want... No, thank you. I, no, thank you. Don't even like walking past other people. But I don't want to piss when there's other people around. <laughs> Do you get me? Like, that's just gross. 
Also, I'm pretty sure public and school toilets are never cleaned properly. Like, <laughs> no. 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 No, 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 no. No, thank you. I'm not going in there. No. No. I mean, like, if I had children, I'd go in there. If they were in the need of the people, I'm not peeing. I am not sitting my ass on that seat. I'm not going in that stool. I'm not going. Oh uh, no! The only thing I like about public toilets is that little hand dryer because it feels nice. That's it. Like, uh, oh my god, what is that? Why are you eating cotton bud for dumb? Stop eating the rubbish. Have you ever owned a dog that eats rubbish? You eat rubbish. You're meant to be sleeping. Do you not sleep anymore? Do you not sleep anymore? You're meant to be here until two o'clock. Sleep. Okay. Have you ever stolen a trolley? I have not stolen a trolley, as one can see. Um, have you ever owned a dog that's fucking wild? You're wild. Oh, and you're falling. I'm sat on a beanbag here. I can't lean back. I'll fucking break me neck in. On the bed. You're a wild one. He's biting me. Why are you biting me? Have you ever tried to film a YouTube video with a wild dog? He's stolen half my beanbag now. Amazing. And he's off. Have you ever had really itchy ears? <laughs> what the fuck am I going on about? Stop eating the cotton bud! He's eating rubbish. Why is my dog eating rubbish? Archie! Famous! Have you ever found it easier to talk to strangers online that don't live in the same place as you, like the same country, than to talk to people in your own country? Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I've got a lot of teddies. Deal with it. No! This one's mine. You have your own. Archie, no. And now for the rest of the video, we can watch my dog go mental. And that's Dwight on the floor. Archie, no! I'm watching you. It's not yours, Archie. I'm just going to make this video 20 minutes long so for a few minutes we can just watch my dog go mental because I'm trying to think of other scenarios. Have you finished? Oh, I thought of something. Have you ever watched a TV show all the way through, or every single series, every single episode, and then after a while you go back to it and you start watching it again, and you're like, I don't remember this happening. Who is this character? You weren't there before. I swear you died, but you're like, then you didn't die throughout the whole entire series. Like, what is going on? Like, that, that happens to me a lot. Like, I'm currently re-watching Pretty Little Lies, and I'm pretty sure, like, I, like I don't, did I watch it properly last time? And I was like, Caleb is fit. <laughs> He's fit. Archie. <laughs> have you right? Have you ever watched a TV series once and you feel sorry for a certain set of characters, but then when you watch it again, you feel sorry for a different character completely? Because when I first watched The Big Bang Theory, I felt sorry for all of Sheldon's friends. But then when I, every time I've rewatched it since, I just feel sorry for Sheldon. Because like, they, 
sometimes they have treated him really like horribly like i know they're just joking but like it's kind of mean <laughs> like i always end up feeling sorry for sheldon now archie you're not allowed on the window you're not allowed by my windowsill get down have you ever owned a disobedient dog archie I can't even see him. There he is. Oh, he's opened my window. Ew, or my curtains. Ew. The sun. Um. Archie, no! Archie! 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 Ah! Ah! Oh! <laughs> um, have you ever changed your accent so much in a conversation that you've confused the person who you're talking to? What are you growling for? What, what, what's that? Wow. Nothing. Nothing is there. This is amazing. I've always wanted to see nothing. Oh my fucking god, there's a fat pigeon in our garden. There's a fat pigeon in it. And you can't see it anyway. There's a fat pigeon in our garden, mate. He's growling at the fat pigeon. It's a fat pigeon, leave it alone. It's fucking fat. It's massive. Have you ever had a fat pigeon in your garden? Just walking around like nobody's business. I love pigeons. And we're closing the curtains. And you're going to sleep like you're meant to be. Okay, and this is um, one for people that have tattoos and piercings. Have you ever been so... S right, people that have tattoos, piercings and scared of needles, this is what it's for. Have you ever been so fucking annoyed when people say, how can you be scared of needles? You've got tattoos and piercings. Especially when doctors and nurses say, I'm like, there's a difference between you, a doctor, giving me an injection and a piercer giving me a piercing. Woof, <coughs> woof. Like, many people have died at the hand of a doctor. But no one has died at the hands of a piercer. That's the difference. Like, we don't like you. You're scary. But piercers aren't scary. Do you get me? Also, a tattoo doesn't hurt. It never does a piercing. Except for a belly button piercing. I screamed my head off when I got that one. Woof, woof. Woof, woof. Woof, woof. I can bark too. I can bark too. Yeah, I can. I can bark louder than you. <laughs> Are we talking? Are we having a conversation here? Who knows? Archie. Archie, leave the fat pigeon alone. <coughs> the dog's mental. <coughs> Have you ever burped? <coughs> woof, woof. Give me a kiss. Oi, kiss. Kiss. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Good boy. You're a clever boy. Are you going to go to sleep? 
Are you gonna go sleep? Arch. Arch. Archie. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Good boy. You only kiss hands, don't you? You're a gentleman. I'm bored and I don't I can't think of any more scenarios and my dog doesn't want me to film, apparently. So I'm gonna go. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you feel like it. Um don't forget to stream all the new Stray Kids songs. I still need to react to 24 to 25 because I still haven't seen that one. I know, I'm naughty. Um, stream any song and video online that you think deserves more views. <coughs> Mine. Um, and have a nice life. Or don't. I can't tell you what to do. Bye bye.